This is Crystal and we're creating label templates in Microsoft Word. If you create labels often, why not create a template? You don't want to do that save as on your previous labels because you may be perpetuating the same problems you had in that document before to the document that you're creating next. So don't do that save as. Here's how you do that template and how you find it. So here, I like to start in a blank document. If I go to the mailings tab, and here in the create group, I click on labels. Now once I'm here, I can actually, notice this is the last label that I created. It was Avery 5263. You know on Avery labels, they always have that four digit number. It's there. But if you don't want that one, I can go to this options right here. And then I can choose from which product number for Avery US letter. Now, that's the standard, but if I click on this drop down arrow, I can choose from any other label vendor. Since that is correct for me, I'm going to actually go and choose 5262 in this list. Here I go. Here's 5262. Click OK. Here's a little sample. Now here, because I've chosen full page of the same label, all I have to do is click New Document. Notice there's no OK there. And here's my label. Now I can actually select the entire label. It's almost like a table. And I can choose to change the font, size, type, color, whatever I'd like in here. Now once I've done that, then I go to my file tab and do a save as. The important part when I do a save as is instead of just selecting, changing the file name, notice it's labels three, I want to save it as a certain type. So I'm clicking on the drop down arrow and I'm going to say it's a word template. Now once I'm in that label, let's say label template for the name. I'm just going to click on save. So there you have it, creating label templates in Word. This is Crystal. See you soon.